VS Code includes built-in refactorings for JavaScript and TypeScript that let you safely convert between default exports and named exports. Here, I've just run Create React App to create a simple React project. You can see that in this JavaScript file, it's using a default export for the app component. Let's say I wanted to convert this to a named export instead. All I have to do is just select the export here, and I'll use the Expand Selection keyboard shortcut to do that. And once I select the export, you'll see that this little light bulb appears. That light bulb indicates that there are refactorings or code actions available. If I click on this light bulb, you can see that one of those options is Convert Default Export to Named Export. So I'll select that, and you can see that VS Code removed the default keyword there. But if I open the source control view, you can also see that VS Code also updated all of the imports to now use a named import instead of the default import. So across the entire project here, it's updated all of the imports so that they are in the correct syntax as well. Let's just go ahead and commit this. And open up app again, because we can actually convert things in the opposite direction as well. So I'm just going to select this export again. Now it's a named export and click on the light bulb. And we can, can now convert this named export to be a default export instead. So when I click this, as you would expect, it inserts the default keyword. But again, behind the scenes here, it's also if we here in the source control view, it's also updated all of the imports. Now use the default import instead. And this refactoring also does support the case where app here uh, contains multiple uh, exports as well, multiple named exports. It uses the correct import syntax for that. So that is the uh, VS Code convert between default export and named export refactorings. They're really useful because they let you make these conversions safely across an entire project.